When we add heat to an object, it gets stored in the form of movement of its atoms. Since atoms are very small, heat cannot be calculated by measuring the movement of individual atoms. We know that temperature is the measure of heat stored in an individual atom. In an object, all the atoms carry same temperature and by measuring temperature, we can measure the heat energy of the object. Thermometer is an instrument designed to measure the temperature. In this video, we will learn about design of thermometer. Thermometer has a tube-like structure which is filled with a liquid. This liquid moves up when temperature rises and goes down when temperature falls. Actually, liquid doesn't move up or down, but it expands when heated and contracts when cooled down. Expansion leads to increase in volume and thus it seems like liquid is moving up but in fact liquid is occupying more volume. Important part of thermometer design is to choose the right liquid. Liquid should expand equally at all temperature. For example, liquid should expand by same amount when temperature changes from 90 to 95 degrees and when it changes from 10 to 15 degrees. Liquid should also be good conductor of heat so that heat can reach to all part of liquid very fast. This will result in less wait time to get correct reading. Liquid should not change state in very small change in temperature. If we use water as thermometer liquid, we cannot measure temperature below zero degrees as water will freeze. Liquid should be shiny so that can be seen by viewers easily. There should not be any stickiness between walls of thermometer and liquid, otherwise expansion of liquid will be disturbed and we will not get accurate results. Generally mercury and alcohols are used in thermometer as liquid as they both fulfill the required properties mentioned earlier. Mercury is shiny and remains in liquid state between minus 39 degree centigrade to 357 degree centigrade. It expands uniformly with temperature rise and it does not stick to walls of thermometer. Since mercury is a metal, it is a good conductor of heat. Alcohol freezes at minus 100 degree centigrade and thus can be used in measuring very low temperatures. It expands more compared to mercury but uniformly with rise in temperature. It is bright in color and hence easily visible. Measurement of temperature not only depends on inner liquid but also tube material and size. To save resources, inner tubes, containing liquid, are made very thin and of less volume. At high temperature, there is always possibility of bursting of tube because of high expansion of liquid. One should always keep in mind the allowed temperature range of thermometer before using it.